Today I'm going to share with you a few ways you can help your child with OCD. I'm Susan Stutzman, a child therapist at Kid Matters Counseling. The term OCD is often thrown around flippantly, but any parent of a child with true OCD symptoms knows the mental obsessions and compulsions are overwhelming. There's a wide range of symptoms. However, most kids who have true OCD will struggle with anxious and worrisome thoughts about specific things that lead to perseveration and checking that never seems to be satisfied. Living with a child who shows signs of OCD is taxing to their caregivers and puts real strain on parent-child relationships. So as a parent, how can you help your child with OCD symptoms at home? Well, sometimes parents think that ignoring the behavior or telling a child just to stop might be the best tactic for OCD. In my work with kids, I've found that the opposite actually is true. If you're able, I would encourage you to lean into what your child is feeling at different times of the day by asking them what their worry thoughts need and then reassure them that they are safe. Once a child feels safe, you can challenge their thoughts and begin to teach them new ways to think and act. Without safety or feeling like someone gets me and sees me, it's hard to get a child to move towards any lasting change. If you aren't sure how to do this, there are some great examples and ideas in children's workbooks that address topics in a kid-friendly way, such as how to change automatic thoughts and promote flexible thinking. One such workbook is What to Do When Your Brain Gets Stuck. It's a kid's guide to overcoming OCD by Don Hubner. One of my all-time favorite story books on OCD is titled Mr. Worry, a story about OCD by Holly Niner. And in this storybook, it's a beautiful story that socializes for a child and parent what it can look like and feel like when OCD takes up so much space in your life. I highly recommend that any parent who has a child with OCD symptoms get a copy of this book to read. Parents, hear this. OCD is hard, but it doesn't have to be a life sentence. If you need additional resources and support to learn more about parenting a child with challenging OCD symptoms, we are here to help. Sign up for our Parent Matters newsletter and follow us on Instagram for more parenting articles and ideas. Or if you would like, give one of our child therapists a call today for a free consult. Parenting is hard, so stay supported and don't parent alone.